Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I just thought I'd do a haul today that wasn't any shop in particular, just new in bits because I've got so many clothes to show you. Um, I've got some bits from ASOS, I've got some bits from Topshop, um, House of CB. Um, I think I'm going to show you some in the style bits. Um, so yeah, quite a few bits, there's probably some that I've missed out as well, um, so I'm just going to get into it. First of all, as always, I'm just going to tell you to follow me on Instagram at laurencrow 88 because there'll already be some pictures of all this stuff up there. And the next thing I'm going to tell you is, this is the first thing in the haul, this Ralph Lauren jumper. I love it. I saw it on a girl on Instagram, I'll try and find her picture and insert it if I do find it. Um, but if not, it will be linked below. It is just gorgeous. It was quite expensive, but I just was like, this is one of those things that is so timeless. It will never go out of style and it looks great with everything. So I'm really happy I got this. I actually ordered it in the wool and this is actually a cotton one. I did want the wool one because I thought if you're going to invest, get the wool. And it was only about 10 or 20 pound more than this one. Um, which I think was about £100, between £100 and £130. Um, but yes, the wool does. I've got a Ralph Lauren wool jumper already and it pills and it looks really old after like one wear. And I think this cotton will wear so much better. So I actually decided to go for the cheaper version, which is unlike me. Normally just throwing money around. I don't know where I think it's coming from. Anyway, yes, this is something I'm really happy with and I'm sure you'll be seeing me in lots. The only bad thing is, is that it's cream and makeup. The next thing I wanted to show you is this ASOS Design Bomber. I actually ordered this just for a haul um, and maybe take a sneak picture, but I didn't think I was gonna love it as much as I did. And now I'm just trying to justify keeping it because it's so nice i actually even ended up ordering it twice because i got it um and then the day later they did the 20 percent off so i ordered it again because i was like i actually think i really want to keep it um so i want it with the 20 percent off so i have two of these and i'm still unsure as to what to do about it but i'll show you on so this is what it looks like on. I just think it's so cool. I did feel like if I put it on, I would look like a 15 year old, but I actually quite like it. Do I look like a 15 year old or is it cool? I think it's quite cool. It's got loads of details. Looks really expensive. It's really warm. It's very padded. Um, yeah, and I just think with a look like this, it looks really cool with like blue baggy jeans too. Um, and yeah, I'm just into it. Like, I don't know. Should I keep it or not? I'm still undecided. So I think it looks cool, but I'm also like, is it one of those things that's just gonna sit in my cupboard? Um, I actually really like it. Oh, I might keep it. The next thing I wanted to show you is this jacket. I actually just posted a picture of it on my Instagram, so I'll put that up there. But this is such a nice jacket. It's from ASOS Design. It's like a quilted leather belted jacket and it feels so comfortable on and it's really padded and warm so i'm going to show you that so this is that one on it's just such a nice classy jacket it's got such a nice neckline i love it with like the collar popped and my hair kind of in it so chic but also undone, it's kind of just casual. I just like it, cream goes with everything. It seems kind of timeless to me. And you can like tie up the bits at the back if you want to, um, to have that kind of more fitted open jacket blazery look. But yeah, I just thought it looked really chic with just a black polo neck underneath. Like that shadow there, it's kind of looking like a polo neck and I'm into it. Um, kind of want to shoot it again now with a polo neck. But yeah, I love it. The next thing that I have from ASOS is this jumper. I love ones like this. As you know, probably have one in every haul um, with just the neck and it looked really fluffy and cute and I thought the colour was really nice too. So I'm going to try it on. So this is the jumper. I actually love it so much. It's such a nice colour. I just don't need any more jumpers. Um, but I did want to show you guys it anyway. Um, I'm not sure whether I am going to keep this one though, I'll be honest. Um, but it is beautiful. It's ribbed. It's got this. This is actually like a working neckline, which I love because you can have some jewellery, 
have it a little open for a little more of a slowly night out. But um, for me, I don't think I'm going to wear it. It's blue. I do love a blue tonal look like this with blue jeans is ideal for me. But um, yeah, I just, I don't know, I'm not wowed. Well, I am wowed. I think it's gorgeous, but I just, it's not making me think I, I personally need it. And I do think that this with my black jeans and my jewel trainers would look so maybe I'll keep it. The next thing I want to show you is this coat from Topshop. I love an aviator and I get a new one pretty much every year, even though I still have the last ones. It's like I'm collecting them, but I just love this olive green colour. And I normally get them really oversized, but I really like this, like short and cute, fluffy around the edges. It's kind of giving me like Lizzie McGuire vibes. Um, I love the green. This colour is all over Instagram, like not even necessarily in clothes. It's just like a vibe, you know, like dark feed goals. I think is what we call it. Kids say. Um, but yeah, I just love it. It looks really nice and simple, just like a white vest underneath, black jeans. Um, so yeah, this is Topshop, I think they have sales going on and it's Black Friday really soon. Um, so yeah, I would definitely advise this one, I think it's really nice and obviously it's super warm, but still trends chic. I'm just going to do a little cutaway next to me of these jeans because I've been living in them. I'm going to add some pictures on my, um, from my Instagram too, but these are the Topshop flares. I actually got them last year, but they're still available. So I wanted to show you them so that you can get them. I need to uncheck that. They're quite tight. They're really like stretchy, skinny jeans. They're the Jamie flares. Um, and I just love how they look sitting over my Prada boots or like over the dual trainers or like over heels. I just think the silhouette of like the flares going like this is just so on trend and it looks so nice. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to film a little cutaway of me in the mirror with them and show you them as well because I think you'll love them. Okay, the next thing that I have is this jumper. This is from Lorna Lux Collection at In The Style. It is super affordable and super cool. Can you see? It's like a, it's like a distressed sweatshirt. <laughs> it's kind of got that old vintage look, but it looks so nice. Um, it's oversized by nature. I just asked Lorna like what size she thought I should get. Um, and she said 10, 12. She was like, it's oversized anyway. Um, so, yeah. I probably would have got it the biggest size possible just because I like to be like, oh, I'm actually going to wear this as a dress. Um, but I think it looks quite cute like this too. Um, and I love that it says New York. And I just think it's such a nice piece, especially for like lockdown. It's cozy, but it also looks really cute to go out in. I love it with like these flares and some heel boots. So I look quite formal on the bottom half, but then I've just got a cool sweatshirt on the top half. So this is something that I love. It comes in a few different colours as well, I think, and different city names. The next thing that I have is this jacket from Miss Pat. As I said, another aviator. This one's Teddy, so a little bit different. So I actually don't have anything like that. It's such an easy thing to throw on, like do it up and it kind of is the outfit. One thing I really love about this is like the black under the collar. I think it really adds a little something to it. It's got pockets, which we love. And yeah, I just, I mean, there's not much to say, is it? It sells itself, it's beautiful. It's got lots of details on it affordable because it's Miss Pat and um, yeah just perfect throw on. I love things like this as well um, where I haven't spent a lot of money but they kind of look cool and expensive um, just because I can wear them on nights out and not be like oh, my heart don't no one can lay me with your drinks. Love this. Okay I've saved this best till last because I wanted to finish the day like wearing this. This is honestly my favourite thing. Oh, I actually just also wanted to, I was just going to put some lip gloss on and I was like, I'll actually show them this. Uh, I saw that this is what Emily Joey wears and I was like, I'm going to try it. And it is actually just the perfect everyday Chanel lip gloss to have in your handbag. And obviously it's a nice treat as well because it's Chanel um, and it is 722 Rouge 
Cup Goal. Um, so that will be linked down below as well. Recently, House of CB, you know, I launched their own sweats line, and all the pieces are stunning. They've got really cute sweatshirts with zips, which you know I love too. But this is just the perfect hoodie. Um, they've got this is what um, the normal hoodies have, House of CB, and they've got sweatpants that say the same. But oh, look what they did for their marketing. House of CB, can you see? Loves Lauren. Focus, how cute. Um, so I feel very privileged to be one of the few people that has one of these. Um, but even if it just said House of CB, it's a perfect hoodie. Like, look at the quality in these. And I love the fact the hood's quite small. First I was like, oh, this feels quite small. But now I realize why. You know a lot of hoods like hang back. Like they hang, like they're heavy on the back. But this kind of sits there and looks really cool like you can really see it from the front so if you had a jacket on and stuff you would just have that look of the hoodie under a jacket really easily um so i love this i think it's going to be the perfect hoodie to layer and just to like be cozy in so nice um definitely check out their whole sweats collection um and i've got so many other house of cb bits and a few Mistress Rocks fits as well actually, so I think there'll be a House of CB haul coming soon. Thanks for watching, sorry I left it a little while, I've been so busy, um, but I am as always trying to improve on my YouTube, so any tips welcome. Thanks for watching, please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and let me know what else you want to see. Remember to follow me on Instagram, bye!